and welcome to Absolute Health Personal Training and Rehab videos. Um, today I want to construct a way um, for you to think about your strength training. Now uh, typically the way um, people think about strength training or their exercise is transitioning from point A in the exercise to point B in the exercise. So um, a deadlift might be thinking about taking a weight from the floor and then standing up and that would be Point A would be on the floor, point B would be stood up, and that would be mission accomplished. But what I want you to start thinking about is um, how you get from point A to point B and what actually creates that. Now generally what we think about um, an exercise is that we create force that takes us from point A to point B. Now humans can't actually create force. If uh, we were an anti-gravity environment floating around, we wouldn't be able to create any force to transition one thing from another, what to another place. So the way I want you to start thinking about it is not force, but creating torque and stability in order to transfer from one place to the other. And I'm going to use a step up in order to illustrate this. So if I'm trying to create a step up, now the normal way that someone will step up is they will keep themselves nice and upright and then in order to go upwards, thinking that they're using this front leg, but it's evident that physics won't allow me to use this leg here to take a straight thing straight upwards. Were I to apply force through here, I'd just move backwards. So the only way for me to get upwards is to either throw myself upwards through the bottom leg, like that, which makes it a standing leg exercise, or to transfer my weight forwards. So the first thing I want you to do is a chain, adopt the position that you need to physically transfer weight properly. So in order to step up, what I have to do is shift my centre of gravity so it's in the middle of this leg and the middle of my back. Now the next thing I want to do is make sure that I'm not using this back leg in order to deliver that force. So I then have to push as hard as I can through this side and then come up. Now the way the force is delivered through this leg is through one, not losing stability, so keeping my knee and my ankle and my hip stable, and two is torque. So if I can create stability from here to here to here, I can transfer my weight upwards with the fact that my muscles cross over each joint, they can create, um, diagonally, they can create leverage and push me upwards. Whereas if I start to use force, I push. Now, as soon as you can start wrapping your head around this concept, it makes it very easy to feel which muscles are meant to be engaging in each exercise. And you can even test balance. So you can see how many step-ups can I do left, how many step-ups can I do right without pushing through either side, and then you'll realise which leg is behind and you can catch the two of them up together. So try and think about exercise as using, um, using torque and stability to transfer yourself from one position to another rather than the A to B thinking, I start here, I end up here, and as long as I do that, that's mission accomplished. Okay, I hope you found that useful. Um, again, if you um, would like to subscribe, just click on the link below and you'll get many more videos like this straight to your inbox. Thanks very much.